you guys would not believe how difficult it is to film something. It's actually really difficult. Anyways, to like my t-shirt, it is from Nasreen Raja and she actually illustrated this and printed it and everything and it's so cool. But yeah, this video is taking forever to do and it's just not working. So anyway, um, what do you guys think of my new look? I'm actually wearing a little mascara and whatsoever, like a little mascara. Today's video is going to be a favourite video and um, I'm quite excited to do this but my scarf just is not working for me today. So I'm ready so I'm going to do um, this month's favourites so no restart 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 okay. <clears throat> Assalamualaikum, hey everybody. So today I'm going to be doing my September favourites and I have a lot of new stuff that I've been trying and um, I've changed up like my skincare routine and my makeup routine and everything I've changed everything up so um, I will be doing like an updated makeup routine and skincare routine I'm really excited to share with you guys my skincare routine because um, I've been using some exciting products and some of which will be featured in this video and um, Okay, let's just get started. I'm gonna start off with something that I'm not actually wearing on today, and it's this is the first. Is it the first time? Okay, it's probably the first time in like three, two, two years that I haven't worn. Yeah, it's the first time in two years which I have not done, and it's wearing mascara. I've been wearing mascara for probably two years, non-stop, every single day. Cannot go without it. But um, it's really weird because since my skin has cleared up and wet and um, I don't know, like my eyes, now they decide to reply back to me. You know, I've been waiting like three hours for my friends. Let's see, what's this? Not important. Okay. So yeah, I've been loving this... Um, new mascara, there's two actually, the new Dior one that I just recently bought but I didn't love it enough to include it in this month's favourites but I did include this one, well I am including this one and it's the Givenchy one, I don't know what make this is or anything, I actually bought this off Depop and seriously I don't like it when people call me when I'm filming, so yeah and um, the wand looks like this, so it's like three little balls and honestly this mascara is amazing, I absolutely love it. Um, you can give yourself a perfect natural look and also you can build it up and it separates, like you don't get clumpy eyelashes at all, this is amazing and as I mentioned in my other video I've been trying to find um, really good mascaras because my L'Oreal ones are finishing and I don't obviously, you know, boycotting and stuff. So anyway, I don't know about if Givenchy, okay, it's not Givenchy, sorry, Givenchy, do, um, what's it called? Um, I can't talk, why did I not talk? Okay, so anyways, I've been babbling on for three minutes about one freaking thing, okay need to get it together anyway I've been loving this mascara and it's amazing and I did buy it off Depop so I think Depop is a great place to get stuff especially if you just want to try out high-end things and all sorts and like with makeup and stuff you can sanitize it um, I don't think you can sanitize mascara though I'm not sure I don't know about that but yeah this was new so it's okay and um but yeah, I've been loving this. It's amazing. It's really, really good. And the like I said before, L'Oreal has been the only brand that works for my eyelashes. And the fact that this works too, I just got so excited. It's amazing. It's such a good mascara. Like seriously, guys, I think 
you should invest in this because it's so worth it. I need to stop talking about that. The next thing is I'm always I got I love red lipsticks. Absolutely love them. I used to hate them because I used to think they didn't suit me. But recently I've been really loving these and I have a few favourites. And at the moment I am loving the one I'm wearing on now, which I believe is the dupe. Is it Russian Red or Ruby Roo by MAC? But it's a dupe for one of them and it's amazing and it's way better than the MAC one. Look, can I just say? lasts long um it's creamy and like it's matte but as you can see it's very creamy it doesn't get dry it doesn't dry out my lips at all it's just amazing looks like this wearing it on now and this is by revlon though so um that's the only thing and it's in shade really red 06 okay next thing i've been loving is something i recently bought and it's the ysl tushy clap and I never bothered getting into this hype. I was always like, nah, not interested, no point. But, okay, not only is the packaging absolutely amazing, YSL packaging is just, wow. It is amazing, it's expensive, and it actually looks expensive. So that's always a plus. Um, yeah, I was never really into this. I was just like, oh, whatever, it's just overhyped. But then I was at the makeup counter and like I was getting tips from a really good, what do you call them, makeup assistants or whatever you call them at the counter. And he was actually really good and he gave me some really good makeup tips and then he put, he put this on me and it made an amazing difference. Like you can just see it. and I love that it's light because I don't need heavy Basically, my under eyes are kind of going through, I don't know what's going on, but I can't use any thick concealers because it just, it goes all cakey, I get lines, and like, I obviously don't have wrinkles, but you can see, like, the lines more. So, um, yeah, I couldn't, I basically can't use anything at the moment, but this was amazing, so this is the only thing that my under eyes can take at the moment, and I've been loving it, it's perfect. Um... Like, my friend has really bad under eye, um, what do you call them? I don't even know what they're called because, like, I don't have it. Oh, my God. Blank memory. I told you I can't film today. Um, under eye. Dark under eye circles. That's what it's called. Okay, so she has were really dark and he put it on, like, on one eye and it was such a huge difference. I was like, wow, it actually looks good and it wasn't the lighting because when we went out like you can see the difference okay so that's the other thing okay next thing is my absolute baby this is my little baby because um as ruby says let me let everything's your baby that's why you're broke you need to like stop spending okay so this is actually the sunny clear from michael todd and this is um, basically like another version of the Clarisonic however it is way better also I believe it's cheaper and their products also it comes with like all their products are organic and made with organic real stuff and um, it's really amazing also this I will do like a full if you guys want me to I'll do a full review on this let me know I'll even I'll do a blog post if you guys want a video please let me know in the description box below not just in the comment box below um, and it has so you put it on and there's three settings and um, it's just I use this every single day and I love it it has saved my skin it's literally saving my skin it basically comes like this and it's basically it's like antibacterial and it's a sonic skin cleansing brush and it's just amazing i've been using this for i've been using this for over three weeks now and it's amazing and like seriously it's helped my skin so much and i absolutely love this Okay, next thing is, um, actually I got sent um, my Eid gift. It's really cute of her. I can't believe she did this. You're so sweet. Thank you. I don't really get Eid gifts, to be fair. So this quite, was quite exciting. But I got these two t-shirts from Yaz Raja Designs. And oh my god, I just realised she even wrote my name. But yeah, this, is, um, this isn't really a monthly favourite. It's kind of... To be honest, she's my favourite illustrator, so it it counts as 
um, what's it called? My favourites. So yeah, this is, it's like, look at this. So she's doing t-shirts now and I absolutely love the packaging. It's so cute. Everything's amazing. Like her little sticker logos. And I got this shirt and I love this. And everybody has seen this on the internet. And it just says, judge me by what's in my head and not not what's on my head so um yeah that's really pretty and i love this one i'm actually wearing this one and this one says i don't have i don't have a boyfriend i have chanel her hermes and diamonds and then it's got the hermes bag i absolutely love it the fit is amazing as well so thank you for that and i also got some cards and stuff but i'll share that all in another video so this video is actually longer than I thought it would be. I thought I'd get through these stuff really quickly. The other thing I've been loving is I've dwelled into the world of eyeshadows, which I never have before. And my friend Molly was said that this is a dupe for the Too Faced chocolate palette. It, I believe it's called the chocolate palette, isn't it? Yeah, this is like an obvious dupe. It's even called Death by Chocolate and the packaging is chocolate. And this is from I Heart Makeup, which is basically Makeup Revolution and i absolutely love this palette this is my favorite palette the colors i like this and i love this absolutely love this palette because these are the kind of colors i wear and i only really wear these kind of nudie pinks and browns and um, i feel obviously because i don't go anywhere fancy that's kind of my everyday range i love it and it even it actually smells like chocolate as well. I just realised that and I've been using it for a while. And I love it. I just really, really love it. And well, how much is it? Is it £4? £7? It's it's No, it's £7.99 £7 I believe. And it's so worth it. And it's amazing. And I really wanted the Naked 3 palette. And I feel like this is really close to it because of all the pinks and the browns and the nudes. Okay, next thing is I bought... My skin is really, really weird. So I've been looking for powder for possibly five years. And I finally came across one. It's almost amazing. It's almost my holy grail. Only one problem. So it's from NARS. And this isn't powder. This is actually powder foundation. Um, but I, pref I like my powders to have coverage because when I'm topping up, Throughout the day, I do like it because sometimes my makeup kind of comes off, so I like to add it on in the bits where there isn't, if that makes sense. Anyway, I got it in light, number one, Siberia. Problem is, I have to be really careful with this because it does make me look very, very white. It's The thing is, this, the shade darker than this is way, it's too dark for me. It like it's not very it doesn't look very natural this is this suits me better but at the same time it makes me look so white um that's the only downside but this powder is amazing and it doesn't make my skin flaky it doesn't go all horrible and because i have combination skin it works for both basically so keeps the oiliness gone and it also doesn't dry out my skin it's just amazing absolutely love it and also i rediscovered an old favorite of mine and you guys would not believe the difference a makeup brush would make would would make yeah the difference a makeup brush would make like you guys seriously would not believe because i've been using um my other ones my other favorite ones which are by Sedona Lace, I love them. However, the one that's like this, this one's less dense and I find that I get a more natural application with this brush and it's the Sigma Flat Kabuki F80. Seriously girls, if you don't want to look cakey and stuff, make sure your Kabuki brush is not too dense because you will end up caking way too much on and it doesn't look natural, it doesn't look good. So the denser the brush, the better. Also, if you want very light coverage, make sure it's not too dense like not too many bristles not bristles not too many hairs in a brush so yeah i've been loving this and this is what's been giving my skin a flawless look basically um next thing is 
something that I wanted to share so solely for the purpose of I'm always looking well I, before I always used to look for mirrors and stuff because I get bored of like the little ones and then they have a print on it and then the print kind of goes out of fashion or it looks too babyish or you change your style and you need something new so makeup and I hate small mirrors I don't understand what's the point like I just don't get that anyway found this it's really sleek suits everybody and it's amazing and also it is very big but at the same time you can have it because it's so thin you can have it in a clutch you can have it in your bag you can have it anywhere and it fits so it's like this there we go and um it's from muji and i believe it was five pound or 5.99 which is i think is really good especially for muji and this mirror is just amazing okay i have a few things left yay okay the next thing that i've been loving is i finally got to try after like four years of me watching people hype about it the liz l cleanse and polish hot cloth cleanser they now stock it in boots thank you boots it's about time you've been selling this like i've been waiting so so long so yeah um i i love this and also i didn't know that it's quite it's quite natural and stuff and it smells amazing it's got peppermint rosemary well actually it's not peppermint sorry it's eucalyptus essential oil rosemary chamomile and cocoa butter and they are my favorite smells i love this it gets my makeup off really well it's not perfect like you will need to double cleanse or you can take all your makeup off with a like a cotton bud not cotton what am i saying Take it off with a makeup wipe and then go on with this and I think you'll be okay. But I I do this, so I rub it into my skin, get my muslin cloth, take it off and then go in with this and I love that. It's just perfect. And the other thing is, ah, okay. The other thing I've been loving is, it's the chamomile cleansing butter, which looks like this and it smells, oh my goodness. amazing it's like you just don't you, don't you guys don't get it it smells so amazing it is absolutely amazing and i can't get enough of the smell like i really 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 love this smell i wish i need to find a candle that smells like this because it's absolutely amazing and the product itself is very good so not only does it smell amazing it actually works and i love this and this is my first ever cleansing butter and I love it and I still get the hype and this is perfect if you guys have dry skin so um I don't know I guess it's a little pricey but then it depends who you compare to but you should I don't know if boots does anybody do stuff like this that I can get in sh in store because I hate online shopping last thing is I've I was in blue banana I, I spend so much time there, it's it's unbelievable how much time I actually spend in there. Um, like I go there all the time. And they've got no, new nose rings which are like this, you probably can't see. But they're different colours, so there's a pinky lilac, there's a, blue, there's a sky blue, there's a green, there's silver, pink, white crystal, blue, um, royal blue and red. And I love these because now I can match them to my outfits. And also they're a little bit bigger than my other ones, which I like. And they, they're they just straight and then they have like a little ball at the end, which I really like because they end up staying in my nose. The other ones that are like curved, angled, they're like that. They basically, they just keep coming out and it's really annoying and you can see them. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It was kind of all over the place because I'm a little all over the place today and I don't know, I find recently I've been finding talking videos a little bit difficult to do. I need to get back into the routine of actually filming more talking videos and I really enjoy them and I love watching favourites videos. They are my favourite videos to watch. I love favourite videos and um so i really want to be doing more of them and i'll see you in my next video okay now i need to find that damn remote which i lose all the time like 
I lose it every five seconds and I have no idea where I put it. Right, so I'm going to be going. I really love this outfit and as you guys can tell, my style has changed quite a bit. Okay, I need to stop doing this video. It's like freaking 30 minutes long. Okay, so...